What if you were to find out that every time you made a contribution to a qualified retirement plan, the math will show the Internal Revenue Service getting a better rate of return than you? When would you want to know that the actions that you're taking to, to supposedly to build wealth will in fact hurt you the more successful you want to be? Look, I think we all should know the rules of the game we're trying to play. And I'm going to give you an example. If I make a $10,000 contribution when I started my qualified retirement plans at the age of 20, and at that time I was in a 10% tax bracket, effective bracket, not the marginal one, effective. I saved $1,000. No, I postponed my tax bill. They've loaned me a thousand to incent me to play this game, and then I make the mistake of succeeding. Watch what happens when you succeed. The tax bracket will, that you will pay on the day that you pull the money out, and let's assume you hit it rich and you made it and you're at the top of the food chain. You're at a 37% tax bracket. That $10,000 that you put in where the government gave you a thousand to play, you owe 3,700 on that contribution. They will go back and take 2,700 more dollars from your contribution. What's the rate of return on that deposit where the government gave you a thousand and you owe them 3,700 and you put in 10,000 and got to spend 6,300? You lose money and the government made money. Is that how you're explaining why contributing to a qualified plan makes sense? I sure hope this helps. If you want to learn more about how wealth works, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and like our Facebook page, Tom Love, How Wealth Really Works.